Okay, let me try it again. Is God worthy to be praised? Yeah. I said, God. I didn't yeah. say your name, but I said, yeah. I said, is God worthy yeah. to be praised? We honor the Lord in your presence. I think, you know, we're going to pray and look at it a little more. It might be time to, to move to one service. Amen. Might be time. Somebody's, amen. We're going to pray and think about it, but amen. And, uh, which is okay. We'll see. See, like me, every time when I mention that, then people start coming. Uh, so. <laughs> Man, I guess maybe I don't want me to do it, but the nine o'clock was uh, as well, as well, as well. We thank God for that. Let us stand in the presence and honor the Lord as we come to worship Him. We come to worship Him in spirit and in truth. Why? Because He is worthy. He is worthy. Amen. I don't know about you. I went to sleep. I didn't know I was asleep. Yeah. If I was snoring, I didn't know I was snoring. Right. But I do know this. It was God that woke me up. That's right. That I do know. Amen. Right. And it's all living good. Here. Yeah. Amen. Amen. Hold that in my right mind. That's right. Amen. 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 To God be the glory. Yeah. Amen. Amen. Yeah. God be the glory. Oh. Let me do this and I won't have to do it no more. I'm going to do the announcements as we call to worship. Let me pray first. Lord, we thank you now. Thank you. As we come to worship you in spirit and in truth, we pray, God, you move by your power. You would give us just what we need. Because if you give us just what we need, it's more than enough. Thank you for loving us. As we come to worship you in spirit and in truth, lift us inspire us, encourage us, yes. uh, let us know that we are not alone. We are loved that we are not alone. Bless as only you can. In the name of Jesus, I pray. And every heart said, Amen. Amen, Amen. Say, Amen again. Amen. Say, Amen again. You may go to your seat. Thank you for your support. The two families on last week, the Allen Sistrunk and the Irvin family. Thank you. Say, bro. Church still in morning. Amen. Been that way for a while, but God can be trusted yes. in the midst of whatever's going on. Yes. Sad to announce we have a Russell family also. Deacon Russell lost her his sister. Uh, her name was Nancy Sloan. She used to sit in the back, live down the street. She moved to Birmingham because of health, health reasons. Uh, and they want to bring her back service. Most likely it'll be Friday, Saturday. I don't know what time, uh, but we will announce that when we have more details. Bible study Wednesday at 6.30. Come and be blessed. Amen. 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 If you have problems seeing it at night, uh, uh, put, put, your, put your beams on high. Amen. That pole be a little sense of humor there. You can't see too good at night. Put your beams on high. High beam until a car comes. Or you want to ride, you need a ride. But I do know, know and understand you, you need some word. Hallelujah. And you need some fellowship because we are dealing with some tough times. Oh, tough. Amen. But God is tougher. Now. Don't get me wrong. I'm not going to fold on the pressure. I'm not going to fold on pressure. But we do have some situations. Deacon about Um, Dean Boswell, it's, it's, uh, let's pray for that family. He's in uh, RMC intensive care. So let us do something. Yeah, made a the deacon wives and the church. They gonna do something to help. So Cochran will be taking care of that to help encourage that family. Her, he served here a long time. Say faithfully. So it could be, it is our family, but it, it could be our immediate family. Right. Amen. We're not exempt Amen. from troubles and trials. Amen. Amen. We are not. Thank God for that. So pray for that family as well. 
Now come on. Amen. I know these men waiting to eat you and to bless us. So come on with it. Amen. Whatever God has given you. Amen. amen. So we'll go on in the service. God is spoken. Let the church say amen. Amen.
Amen. Some people you don't need in your life. Amen. But when you got a friend that sticks closer than a brother, those are the kind of people you need in your life. Using for a message, talking to the right one. And believe in the right things. Amen. Talking to the right one. They was talking to Jesus. That's right. Amen. And Jesus was talking back to them. That's, right. Amen. That's what the text says, right? Yeah. Yeah. Even when it said many of them, some of them walked away and didn't walk with him no more. So Jesus said, are you going with the crowd? All right. All right. Well, are you going to stay with me? Yeah. It mean what? They had a conversation going on. Am I right about it? Amen. Then they responded. Amen. Now Jesus, I think we going to stay with you. All right. mm -hmm. Because what? You're telling us the right thing. Right so what? They come to a conclusion. We're talking to the right one. Mm -hmm. And what? We are believing the right thing. That's right. All right. Thank God for his word. Can I remind you today that Jesus is our present help? Uh -huh. That means what? He, 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 he don't have to show up yesterday. He already took care of it. Right. He's our present help. He's right now yes. help. Yes. In the time of whatever we're dealing with, he's right now, right here, right now to help us. And the Bible said, what they that wait upon the Lord shall renew their strength. So what? He's right now help. So if I need right, right now strength, guess who I'm calling? I'm calling on the one that got what? That got all power. So if he got all power, he got all strength. Yeah. Yeah, man. I pick up a paper and read it sometimes. But I don't trust the newspaper. I don't trust the little section that said they were going to clown me. Amen. Amen. That put up in my heart's gonna be. I'm not hating on nobody, amen. I'm not hating, but I don't believe, amen. I don't look like no bull. But said Taurus the bull, amen. I don't even think like a bull. All right, all right, all right. It's all right. All right. Amen. Talking to the right one and believing the right thing. I said that to make plan. I didn't say I was hating on you. I'm saying me. And you, you go ahead on, amen. I'm talking about me. Isn't that right? In the Bible, in the biblical, in our biblical message here today, it is for our edification, it's for our uplifting, it's for to encourage us. When we go into the Word of God, we ought to be with expectation to get encouraged, to get inspired to what we need. Also, this text teach us, amen, that people is going to leave you. But don't get all in uproar. Don't get all up and amen. Go ahead and analyze, analyze the situation. All right. And then talk to the Lord about it. That's right, that's right. He might just tell you that person was the problem in your life. All right. All right. Am I right about it? Right. Yeah, amen. Because what? Some folk you don't need. All right. All right. Some that you need, God will leave them right. and work it out with you. Right. Because what? Some people you do need, we do need one another, but some folk we don't need, but we all need the Lord. Right. 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 Isn't that right? Yeah. And we need to cast all our cares, we need to learn to cast all our cares upon Him. Uh -huh. Why? Because He cared for us. Exactly. In the text, amen, amen, we, we see the crowd, we see the crowd, mm -hmm. some of the crowd had the part. Right. So that asks me, that, that poses to us a question. Why did they leave? You have witness here. Because what? When somebody ever even the part of our lives? Amen. We always wonder why. Or should I say, there's always a reason why they left. In this particular text, amen, in this particular situation, as long as Jesus was saying what they want to hear. Then, hey, man, everything was fine and dandy. But when he got to talking about, hey, man, grace and mercy. All right, all right. Long as he was talking about the law, the Jews here was fine. Right. But when he started talking about loving everybody in the world and then going outside of the little group called the Jews, they had a problem with what he was saying. Can I help you today? And long, and, and let me tell you about a true friend. A true friend will stick there with you through thick and thin, and they will tell you the truth. But amen. But but but, but let you start talking about some with some people that don't want to hear. They'll leave you. Am 
am I right? Go along. And Jesus was saying what they wanted to hear. As long as there was no confrontation. As long as things was smooth and cool. They were good to go. Amen. And some folk can love me as long as I don't preach about their sin. Oh, you the greatest pastor in the world until you start talking about their sin. Then they get upset. Then they want to leave the church. Well, guess what? If you get upset about something that's in the book, amen, you go and come back, I'm still preaching out that same book. The wages of sin is death. Amen. That's the first part. You left your church slave from the second part. The second part is, but the gift of God is eternal life through Jesus. Talk to me, somebody. Amen. So I said, he was saying, you know how people is? All right, all right. They good. Yeah, no, yeah. you don't say nothing that they don't want you to hear. Yeah, that's, right. that's right. Am I right? Yeah. Now you're meddling. Now you're meddling. Now you're meddling. All right. Yeah, man. I got some license to meddle. Everything was fine. But when he started talking about the law of my grace, he said, hold, 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 hold. Stop the car, Jesus. Hold up. We are. Jew, we are the chosen. All right. We are the elite right. crowd. We are the ones that's the best. Thank you, Lord. Jesus said, well, I'm going to paraphrase. He said, well, yeah, in the Old Testament. He said, but I said I love the word. All right. So I just can't just love just the curve. All right. Amen. I got to love the Mar Morgans too. Yes, sir. That's right. Am I right about it? I'm just making it plain. Amen. Amen. So Jesus said, all of you all are my elite group. Yes. Why? Because you trust me. All right. And I'm talking about the right thing. Yes, Amen. And you talking to the right one. All right. All right. So go ahead and talk to the right one yes. and believe the right things. Yes, Am I right about it? But John 3.16 says, Church, for God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son. I'm going to hold on to that because what? I, 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 God loved me when folk act like they don't love me or don't love you or don't love you. God loved me. So what? I got somebody to love me when folk said they don't love me. I got at least three people that love me. I got God the Father. I got God the Son. I got God the Holy Spirit. Amen. 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 
the devil in the pulpit. All right. He just can't preach. All right. All right. All right. All right. All right. All right now. All right now. Tell me somebody. All right now. Hey man, he, 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 he just can't preach. Oh, yeah. He can say what? But he can't preach. You know why he can't preach? He don't love the Lord. Amen. If he don't love the Lord, then he don't love people. Amen. He don't know nothing about, amen, the wages of sin and death and the gift of God, the eternal life. He don't know nothing about repent and believe that the gospel. He don't know nothing about, amen, that you confess with your mouth and believe in your heart that God has raised him from the dead. He lost. He don't know nothing about that. He straight lost. Matter of fact, he got kicked out of heaven talking all old crazy stuff. Help me, preacher. Help me, preacher. So he don't know nothing about it. He may grab the mic, but he can't sing. All right. Not, 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 not no Christian music. Now he can do that rap stuff. All right. I'm spitting on up. Amen. But he can't sing uh, spiritual. Huh? On my way home, yeah, he he can sing that one. All right. He just out of tune. And he on the way home, but it's not helping. All right. All right. All right. Talk to him or something. Amen. So. So they said, well, hope, Jesus, we got, we got a problem. Mm -hmm. They start mumbling. They start arguing. Uh -huh, right. Did not believe this because what? They didn't know what they, you know what they said. This Jesus don't know what he's talking about. Mm -hmm. All right, come on, break it down. Don't folk do it like that. Amen. You don't know what you're talking about. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And then a lot of times people that's ungodly will try to talk about godly stuff and don't know nothing about it. Amen. The Bible tells us, amen, we don't need to take no advice from nobody that don't know the Lord. That's right, right. amen. Blessed the man that walking out in the council of the ungodly. Not standing in the seat of the sun. Hey Amen. I don't take my advice from somebody that don't know the Lord and don't come to church and don't know care nothing about church. Hey amen. And hate everybody. I take my advice from the one that said high and look low. The one that died, hey amen, on Calvary. The one that went in the grave and took the stand out of death. He said, I'm going to leave your company. I'm going to have the Holy Spirit here to help you. That's where I take my advice from. And the word said, hey Amen. His delight. Is in the law of the Lord. I mean in the word of God that he meditate day and night. Hey, hey man, I got to read God's word in the morning. I, I got to read God's word in noonday. I, I got to bless my Lord at all times. Uh, his praise shall continue to be in my mouth. It's not just a book in my house. It's a blessed book that got the word of God in it. And I read it to be blessed. Uh, I read it to be inspired. Uh, Somebody mm -hmm. that talk back with some sense. All right. Yeah. Yeah. Yes, sir. Yeah. Yes, sir. Back. Yes, sir. The Lord. Mm -hmm. I do talk to people that talk crazy. Uh -huh. Amen. Mm -hmm. Every family got some. Uh -huh. All right. All right. You don't have to look around. Right. Amen. You got a family, you got one. Right. You might have two or three. <laughs> Amen. In your family. Right. So you better talk to the Lord. Cause what? We have great folks in our family sometimes. Amen. I'm talking about my family. I ain't talking about you. Amen. Amen. I said, hold on, Jesus. You don't know what you're talking about. So verse 6, 6 says, yeah. mm -hmm. and see, uh, also see here that many will lead church. Mm -hmm. Amen. But you can't lead alone. All right. Amen. If you got him, right. you can't lead. Right. Am I right about it? Amen. Because his presence is with us. Uh -huh. Amen. 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 Now Adam tried that. Mm -hmm. God said, okay. Go on, do what you're going to do, you little stuff. All right. <laughs> he said, I got you. Go on. Amen. See, we're saying sneak. He's sneak. Sneaky. All right. I don't mind about talk to that lecture today, do you? It's all right. Yeah. Amen. Yeah. Amen. He, he, so he said, he said, no. Adam pretty tough. He's he pretty strong. All right. I, I'm, let me get a shot at Eve. All right. Yeah. Work with it. Yeah. He told Eve, he's in that garden. They tell you that. Right. So what? He took secondhand information. All right. Yeah. And a lot of times people take secondhand information. What do I mean by that? Amen. Something they don't hear. All right. All right. All right. You know what? Mm. Right. I even got a text. I ain't got to tell you who it's from. I'm not gonna tell you about something. Uh -huh. It it wasn't true. All right. All right. But they want, just wanted to be the first one to tell. Come on, say amen. Amen. You know, you got that social media. Mm -hmm. Folks throw stuff on there for the evening. I told my sister, don't you tell my kid nothing about my mom. 
Don't put it on Facebook. That's my business. I tell them. Yeah. That's right. Isn't that right? That's right. Amen. That's exactly right. I, I'm the one that needs to tell them. Man, so sometimes I just want to stay tough. I mean, stay. Let me get that. It's all right. Let me get all right. That. But, have mercy. They, the people will leave and they will quit stuff just because they get upset. Yes, mm -hmm. yes, yes. Mm -hmm. I just think that the Lord do us that way. Amen. 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 Many times, many broken promises we have with the Lord. Yeah. Yeah. Many times we don't promise this and did that. And amen. And at least a little thing with us, we want to get our little person pocketbook and stick and whatever and take off. Yeah. Yeah. All right. All right. And the Lord probably look at us sometimes and say, You ought to quit. He probably said the other word we used to say when sometimes out in the street, you know. All right, all right. <laughs> that ENP. Yeah. Uh, you figure it out. Amen. Verse 6 to 6. Let me get back. <laughs> From that time, not all but many mm -hmm. of his followers, all right. that's what disciple means, mm -hmm. had an attitude. Mm -hmm. Sit down. Went back and walked no more with him. All right, all right. For reason there was a lack of understanding. Mm -hmm. Turned and walked away. They were disappointed because they didn't believe. Well, faith is, is the substance of things hoped for. All right. The evidence of things not seen. Not seen. Yes, when you trust God, uh -huh. wait on the evidence. Uh -huh. He may not come when you want him, but he's always on time. Amen. The Bible said in, in Hebrew 11, 6, he that cometh to God must believe that he is who he say he is. And he's a rewarder of them that diligently seek him. Amen. Trust him, stay there and wait on him. 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 Amen. He, he said he'll never leave us nor he will save us. He said he promised us he'll be with us to the end of the world. Stay there and wait on him. So they left because they were disappointed. And Christ was telling them something that wouldn't let them down. All right, Keep talking to the right one and believing the right things. Jesus said to them in, in John 6, 48, he said, I am the bread of life. All right. Amen. You have to eat to have eternal life. Yes. He also said the spirit quicken, mm -hmm. make you alive. Yes. The flesh profit nothing. Right. Don't follow the flesh, y'all. Mm -hmm. The flesh will get you in trouble. Yes, but try the spirit by the spirit. Amen. This flesh will take you further than you want to go. Will cause you more than you want to pay. Will keep you longer than you want to stay. Then the Bible said they turned and went away. But I stand to tell you today that I'm glad that all of them didn't go away. Amen. Somebody said I'm staying with Jesus. Yeah, yeah. Somebody in the text said, the Lord has been too good to yeah, us. Right, right. Amen. The Lord turned me around and placed yeah, yeah. my feet on a solid ground. Yeah, yeah. The Lord stayed with me when my friends talk, walked away from me. Yeah. Amen. They said, I'm staying yeah. with Jesus. Yeah. And Jesus said, will you go away also? And Peter and said, I'm staying with you, Lord. You've been good to me a long time. Matter of fact, from the rocking of my kratom, you've been good to me. When they turned and brought away me, amen, you were right there to take care of me. When the doctor said one thing, Lord, you were right there to take care of me. And Peter said, I don't want to Nowhere to go. You got the word of eternal life. You got the word that will keep us from falling. You got the word that will save us. You got the word that will heal us. You got the word that will bring us peace. You got the word to God Almighty. We'll stand with the living word. But the word tells the church man is written. Man cannot live. 
on in your room. Come on in. Yes, sir. Heal my doctor. Yes, sir. Right up. Yes, sir. Oh, my. I'm a witness. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yeah. Then give me my medal. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Woo. Yes, Amen. Amen. Yeah. Y'all feel good? Yes. Y'all yeah. feel good? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. I'm, cool. I'm not quite sure what James Brown was talking about. But I know what I'm talking about. Amen. And he all right, church. Thank God for his word. Yes. Thank God for his spirit. Yes. If you're talking to the right one, he believe in the right things. Yes, sir. Amen. Amen. We're not going nowhere, Jesus. Amen. You, you tell the truth, and we believe it. Amen. But I will say again, some people you don't need in your life. Let me tell you, let me say this. When you're really trying to live for the Lord, you don't have no love for him. Amen. No way. Amen. No, you don't. Amen. Because no. what? You trying to do it right. Amen. They still looking for that some little stuff, that little soul. They don't want to turn loose. That's why you got, when you, the more you get in the Word, the more the Word in your spirit, yeah. amen. You won't have a desire for them things. You take it away, amen. Amen. And what God takes away, He always replaces it with more than we need. Hallelujah to the Lamb of God. Isn't He worth the church? Anybody want to get saved today? Double day, you to open your heart and come down and say, Lord, I repent, I believe, and I want to be saved. He'll do it to you. He'll do it. You hear me say all the time that we're not, our salvation not based on how we feel, based on what we believe. Amen. I don't feel good all the time, but I still believe. Christ. Jesus is the Christ. Amen. Amen. I can get happy in the Lord. Amen. 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 But I, I don't have to put on a show for nobody. Amen. To make you think that I'm running up down the aisles to make you impress you to get saved. I'm messed up already. I'm trying to impress you. But I need to try to inspire you. That's right. Isn't that right? Amen. Amen. So thank God for his word and the solidness of his word. I told the deacon candidate this morning, right? I said, the first thing, open your book and write it down. I'm a servant. Amen. I'm a servant. And that will keep you humble. Amen. Amen. Rather than walking around with your chest stuck out saying, I'm this and I'm that. Amen. And what the hill be. Amen. Get you going. God said, let you humble yourself. That's it. Under the mighty hand of God, right. he will exalt you mm -hmm. in due time. Right. Yes. Amen. Amen. Thank God for his word. Amen. So everybody say, you might want to come and say, give, 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 give the Lord my hand and 